We got $5 drinks here at the Sportsman's Lodge. Show up for the $5 drinks. Stay for the great sports talk or the free tacos and churros. Great sports talk. Masseuse, four of them. Masseuse times three. Vic the Brick in a giant rice paddy field hat, I guess. And what a shock. He's hanging out by the fortune teller. The fortune teller who is here to have your fortune told. You lovely ladies that aren't. Here for the show. I you think. don't have to hop off the five at Dittman. We got a fortune teller right here. Go see her. Take advantage of it because it may be your first and only chance to do so. When I used to live in Koreatown, you know, you were really good to drive down just like a normal residential street and then in a neon sign in somebody's, like, living room window, psychic yeah. with, like, an eye and a pyramid. You're like, yeah, I'm just going to roll up there and knock on that door. That's that's what I'm into. I, I, I'm lost in life. i got to figure i got to ask somebody some questions. Let me just roll up to this person's house on off Country Club and Crenshaw. What it's, do you got for me? <laughs> what do you got? <laughs> hey, I was just driving. I was going to the, uh, the McDonald's, and I saw your sign. What do you got? We have wonderful sponsors of them, Sweet James Bergener at 800-881. 2021, the dense beard of justice is here. He's seen us through all the way to this wonderful pool party on a Thursday. Wide open spaces for you to come and $5 drinks. Hello, sir. I think that tattoo you got back in the day was a good idea. I like that. Hey, I'm with you. Wait till, wait till I take my shirt off, man. Wait till I take my shirt off. Oh, that was cool. No, no. Wait till I take. Look, come on. I got so the. There, go- there are copper pieces of art all over Phoenix backyards with that guy on it. <laughs> You're beautiful, sir, and we're so happy that you're here. It is time for Sweet James Bergener's intro. Ronnie, would you please play that? Order in the court. Order in the court. It's time for Justice with Sweet James. Sweet James Bergener is in the house. The dense beard of justice, 800-881-2021. Cleaner than a Safeway chicken is Such how a great line. Don McClain described him, which was brilliantly done. And uh, James is here at the pool party. Your impression so far... Of the pool party, sweet James. You were at last year's pool party. I was. I've been to every single one. And I I feel like you don't, I mean, though you're embracing the theme, you look like you're kind of on the French Riviera right now. Right. Shopping. Are those ostrich? They are not. What are beautiful shoes. I'm just wearing the, the, I got white pants. It's not a Wednesday, but I'm just in You got white jeans. You got white denim. It's happening. You got a, uh, what is that? Is that a gingham? Is that what they call it? A a gingham gingham. check shirt. It's gingham. And you've. What, what, those are not, that's not cow leather. What is that? I don't know. It's like lizard. It's ostrich. It's something. Are those Bruno Mollies? No. What are they? Berluti. Mm, oh! Berlutis. What was the last time you actually got in the water? And if you win I the, wanted to get in last year. If you win the water right now, how much would it cost? Like 1500 yeah, bucks, right? The water would go. Time. The it shoes would be a would fun go. time. You That's wearing underwear? I might be. Well, let's go. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> you and me. Let's go. Sweet James I'm going to race you down and back. We're doing the fly. Hunt <laughs> fly. You and me. He's not going in the water. He's wearing cufflinks right now. Even Don Martin's not going to show up if he shows up. Cannonball, guys. In cufflinks. There's nobody like our dear friend, Sweet James Bergener, and he's been a great sponsor to us for a long time and a dear friend of the show. We're really lucky to be surrounded by such great people. Don McClain on the sports side and on the legal side, the dense beard of justice. And speaking of all that, is there any update with the Tom Brady thing? Is it still up to this judge? I haven't seen a sketch in, in weeks. What? What is going on with that situation? I think you're going to see a settlement here soon. What do you mean? You've got a judge who's putting pressure on both Brady and the NFL to get this thing done. Especially the NFL. They, they, yeah, the NFL is getting a lot of pressure. You're going to see, you're going to see a reduction. I, I, I think it's going to come down to a two-game suspension. Have you ever had a judge wear you out like this guy Berman is wearing out the NFL um, right now? Not a, No. I mean, he's basically suggesting to them. Do you believe what some people are, are saying that he's indicating – you better settle this because yeah. you're going to lose. I see this all the time. Uh, judges don't want to try a lot of cases. They don't, judges don't want to get involved in this thing. It, it, it's pressure on each side to just get it done. Save some face, Brady. The NFL will, 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 will suspend him for failure to cooperate as opposed to being implicated. Who wins in that? Does Brady well, win? Does the NFL Yeah, win? They, they both win a little bit. Goodell loses a little bit of face. Brady comes out mostly unscathed, but uh, just to get it done and get it going. Now, when they did the last CBA, it was last minute, and that's the way the, the uh, Players Association has worked. It's going to come right to that deadline, and then it will happen. Well, this Brady thing's going to be over with, and my legal troubles are all but finished. I know, right? What are we going to talk done. about? I've got it. And what this will it? not be the first time I mention it today because I am obsessed with this. <laughs> I, I am, what is it? You know what a on. horrible person I am. <laughs> you don't, but Petros does. <laughs> I in what regard? Spent, I'm a, in, I was just in, talking about what a wonderful father in you are. In many right? regards. This is, this is so right up my alley. Okay. I, when I say this, it, it speaks to what a terrible person I am. 
I must have spent. They love that in the pool. 30 minutes last <laughs> night. I must have spent 30 minutes last night pumping every email address I knew into trustify.com slash info to see if they were busted in the Ashley Madison scam. <laughs> because now you can plug an email in to see whether or not that email address was compromised in the hack since they've released every name. Is Trustify like some promise keeper it's group? Like, yeah, it's like a private investigator right. group. And they have every email address associated with all 38 million Holy Ashley smokes. Madison accounts. And you can find out if people you know... If you have their email address. And, and did you find anybody? Nobody. Wow. And, and it's such a great, it's like. Did you put a, me in there? There's a hat. <laughs> yeah, you did. The day my daughter was born, you put me into an Ashley Madison finder account? Oh, <laughs> money. I did not put you in. I did not put you. I would tell you if I did. I did not put you in. You put me in. I did not. And there's only, but, but here's the. Look all you want. You're not going to find anything. Here's the qualifier. Here's the qualifier. I didn't get the peas yet. I was, oh. just going, <laughs> I was just going straight through. My God, so, so here's my question. I do have a okay, question. Okay, okay, okay. Divorce attorneys are going to be raking. Absolutely. Can you do divorce? Have you thought about that? Divorce I mean, you're the you know what? You know what? The first day of law school, I'm in, I'm in family law, and I went, there's no way in hell I'm ever doing divorce But you could law. do it. I, I mean, could? why wouldn't sure. you right now? 38 no. million names registered? Yeah. That's going to be a haul. How long would it take me to get through law school? Do they have a compacted law school? Two where years. I can see Matt wants years. to see families raised. That's yeah, parents, right. Like I'm, the cane I'm, fields. I want to have a giant billboard that says, quick divorce, 24 hours, <laughs> no, you 750 don't. bucks. No, you don't. Does. Let's go. Like Dr. The, Tadoff of divorce. <laughs> right, exactly. exactly. The Dr. Tadoff of all divorce. The div- all, the, all the family law attorneys I know get calls at like 2 a.m. Like, he's Ugh. at the house. I have a restraining order. It's crazy. You don't want that, man. I'm telling you. But with 38 million potential clients, it's not worth it? No. What does AshleyMadison.com do for you? Well, I know what it is, but what do you... You just go on the website and all of a sudden some hot chick shows up to cheat on you with? No. You go to the website. You pay them a bunch of money. What? Yes. Apparently, you have to pay. You have to buy credits. That's how all oh, these websites are. You okay. buy these credits. What, they like post cheating your profile. points? Like SIN cards? Basically. I mean, <laughs> Josh, Josh Duggar's the guy that's, he's like the biggest name that's going down. No. Oh, oh, yeah. I got him. Yeah. And the Not Sports Report will get, his statement is the greatest thing you have ever heard. Okay. But. Be- oh, because he upset Jesus. Exactly. But coming on the I heels of Jared, it's not that bad. Yeah, you're like, oh, at least, do, you know, well, at Jared's... least they're adult, right? Duger. I mean, hey, look, you're doing better than you were. <laughs> I let down Jesus. <laughs> I know I let down my wife, Amy, but I let down Jesus. So wait a minute. What happens? <laughs> let's say I let's say I go to AshleyMadison.com right. right now. You put up a profile. Famous person that I am. Right. And I put up a profile and I say six foot, two fifty. About 35 to 40% body fat currently. Yep. Maybe I put up a picture when I <laughs> what, played football. What are you into? Because, you know, Duger was into cuddling. Okay, I like cuddling. cuddling. Spo- is there a spooning option? Said he had stamina. <laughs> stamina what? daddy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Said stamina said, said, daddy. Said I got stamina. Six-minute man. So you can, you can put in there all, you know, I think the three things were, um, what do we got out there? How are we doing? Hey, look, there's a <laughs> That's Reese's nephew. He doesn't count. Yeah, we got, uh, I believe the three biggest ones were um, threesomes. Okay. Uh, I think it was uh, like quality individual or something like well, that. Well, that's me. Right? So, and I don't remember Wait the third one. Wait a minute. How are you third a- one was cocaine. How are you a quality? <laughs> uh, maybe it wasn't. <laughs> maybe, maybe it wasn't. Is there like a, a puffed white button you can push? <laughs> it's just a bright white horse. Now, wait running. <laughs> if you're on the internet cheating on your spouse. Right. And there is, there's really a quality individual button that you How get to click that? even. Exactly. That's it, exactly. Looking yeah, for classy, yeah. high quality, all those. <laughs> Honest, yeah. sincere, loyal. So, did they you put Vic's name in there? Did they you put Vic? I don't know his email address. Oh, he doesn't have one. Yeah, he doesn't have one. Maybe if you just bang a gong, it would recognize. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, you're, they don't show your name. They just have, you know, your profile, and then you try to match up. Well, do I have legal and... recourse? Let's say I was an Ashley Madisoner. Let's say I'm, I'm Mr. Madison. They guaranteed and your privacy. Yeah, yeah. you might. You very well might. Could we sue yeah. them, sweet James? No, that would be the case. One. That would be the case, the the case against Ashley Madison. I mean, talk about a class action lawsuit. you got 38 yeah. million people yeah. that paid You're a high-profile client I'll and you got burned. Give me a call. Can we sue them before? Can we sue them before Matt gets to the piece? Yeah, sure. We got you. I got you. Sweet James Bergener. I got you. Are you going to hang out? You know what? I've got to run. What? You know what? I... You got, got a trial? I, I do. I got to prep for some stuff. I got no, a you gift don't. For you. <laughs> oh, thank you, sweet James. This is it's a actually gift. not for you. A gift for the baby. Thank you. Do you want yeah. me to open it on yeah, the air? Yeah, why not? All right, I'll open you it can. on the air because it is sure. a, an audio medium, and people. This we'll is like going to a this. baby shower, 
but in sports talk radio. Isn't this great? Isn't this yeah, great? It's great, great sports talk. Oh! That's the best thing. Oh, it's a bearded beanie for the child. <laughs> Pretty great. That, that actually is great. That is fabulous. Pretty great. Do, do we have did a you ba- have that made, or did you find that? I, uh, you know what? I, I have my way. It looks like it was made. Time. That is brilliant. Yes. Yeah. I mean, Either that, that or brilliant. some lumberjack's got a horrible sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> a dense beard yeah, of justice. A pink beanie with a beard. For my daughter. Well, she's going to love it because if there's anything I noticed last night at the, uh, in the nursery was uh, her face is, right. is extremely cold. The AC's on. The ocean breeze. You know, you want to keep her safe. <laughs> thank you, sweet James. And you thank you best. for being a friend. And thanks for being so Always. great thank all you summer to her. Always. No Travel down the road and back again with Sweet James Berliner at 800-881-2021. There's nobody better. We'll be right back with the word number and song of the day. It's PMS on AM570 LA Sports. Live from the Sportsman's Lodge in beautiful Studio City. Come down and jump in the pool and act the fool.